Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernard from the BTN HD, and today is again another Windows 10 video. I know, I know. <laughs> uh, but it's all about your game controller. So I have my Xbox 360 right here, my Black Ops uh, Call of Duty edition. And I've been playing a lot of video games, especially a lot of PC games that deals with uh, controllers. And apparently Windows 10 have Xbox controllers drivers already built in, which is awesome. But sometimes when I'm moving around with the, you know, with the joystick, trying to move to the left or the right, it, it's kind of off. So I'm going to show you guys how to collaborate within Windows 10, which is extremely easy. So we want to get into the all settings. So let's go right here. Click on our little notification panel. Go to all settings. Once the all settings dialog box pops up, you want to go to devices. And within printers and scanners, go all the way to the bottom in devices and printers. It's basically going to take you to devices and printers section. That's it. You can actually do a search within Cortana and just tell it to go to devices and printers and it would take you directly there. Now you're going to locate your device that's connected. For me, it is the Mad Cat's Call of Duty gamepad. Awesome. It picked it up right away. Right click on it. You want to go to game controller settings. Uh, pick the one that you want. You want to go to properties. Once the properties pops up, you're going to get this option right here. You want to go to settings and you want to click on the collaborate. So click on that. You're going to get a nice little collaboration uh, wizard. Just follow it. We're going to click on next. Uh, leave the D pad center, then press a button on the controller. So as soon as I press it, this pops up. So right now I'm moving it. And as you guys can see, the little guy is moving around. So press all the D pad corners and press a button on the controller. So, uh, so there it goes and it moves the Y and then you collaborate and you're done. It's pretty simple. Uh, you got to play around with it until you get the, your game pad the way you want it. Uh, I'm going to click on finish. And that's it. And that's it, guys. As you can see right here, I'm able to move it around. Uh, and the Y, Z axis are just going crazy because I'm moving it. And I'm pressing all the buttons and everything is functioning. Again, uh, best practice, I think for me, best practice, every time you're going to play a new game, just collaborate your, your gamepad because you never know each game that you play is different. Uh, the sensitivity on the game, like left, right, up and down, it's real sensitive in each video game. So I would say collaborate your gamepad before you start playing your game and then you're good to go. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Leave comments right below and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.